Private property trespassers will be prosecuted. How are ye? And you're very welcome to the brand new 2011. I hope 2010 was as miserable and as bad as it was for me. But we can forget all about that. We have a brand new year and we're going to make the most of it. First of all, Happy New Year to all our punters and to all our viewers on YouTube and on Facebook. Now today we're going to talk about three things. We're talking about terrible presents. And the first terrible present that everybody seems to get is the poor old bad pair of socks. This is the first present I unwrapped this year underneath the tree and they're a pair of socks sent from my great 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 grandmother Carmel who lives above in Boris Cane. Carmel, I appreciate the gesture but in fairness you didn't even buy new socks. They were as old as yourself and they smell as bad as yourself. So do you know what Carmel? No more socks, I'm sick of it. Now, the second thing is when you're buying for your loved one. Whether it's for your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your husband, your partner or if you're the other way inclined, that's completely up to yourself. But around November we all have the same conversation. How much are we going to spend on each other? I said to the camera woman this year, we'll have a budget. And she said, how much? I said, how about 30 euros? And she said, all right. And you know what happens? They all try and outdo each other. So I went down to this and that and I bought herself a nice saucepan. It's nothing fancy, it's just an average saucepan. You can put in boiled eggs, fried eggs, you can put a chicken down into it. And if someone had tried to break into your premises overnight, you could whack them down over the head with it. But of course, camera woman had to turn her back and go out and buy something bigger, something better. Now normally, New Year's and years have gone by, I, I'd get a bit upset about it. But this year, she really went and she went wow chi wow and got me every man's dream come true. Before I show you the present, let you know what's happening to hop in this weekend. Of course, tonight is Friday night. Now we've no live music because we want to easy back into it. Then tomorrow night is Saturday night and we're going to be back to the background music and ice creamy pints of Guinness. And then on Sunday, we're back to our traditional Irish Oh Jesus, with PG and the lads, and we have a lad from Australia come and play in the old Bowron. Now, let's have a look and see, but before I show you my present, I have to get rid of all this and change into one of this. I've got one word, lads, Lamborghini. Have a look at it, lads. This is what I got from Camera Woman. Uh, she's a 19.5 litre engine, uh, not to 100 in a split second. Uh, costs roughly about, She'd be well over 35 grand, more than the Focus or the Passat. Come round here, the front row of the camera and have a look. I got one of them personalised number plates. Uh, cost me a few pounds. In Shens for Neil. That's my name. Hop in, that's the place I have an Athen Rye. And in for Malai, or Molly. And of course you can't beat the Canary Yellow. Like that island, um, what's that island called? Mallorca. Now, when here camera woman, I went, woo! <laughs> Jeremy Clarkson ain't your hat out. Now, I suppose you're all thinking, this is mine, she won't even start. Well, I beg to differ. Let's give her a go, camera woman, will we? Yeah! Give me that feedback, camera woman, how's it called? 